We have had two more free-to-play units as part of the fifth year anniversary, and this time they are spitting the episode sagas from the movies, which could give us a bit of a hint for part two of the celebration, but we will see as we go on. But for this video, we're going to be taking a look at one of these brand new free-to-play units being the Full Power Cooler in Rank PvP. This guy does look pretty good. He can do a lot of damage, especially if he's alongside other Lineage of Evil event exclusive or move these characters and he also builds up his buffs whilst he's on standby if your ally is getting hit he can also heal off blast cards and he can also lower sub count with green cards amongst other things as well so we have grinded him out fully to 14 stars so without further ado let's see how he does and let's have a little look at the team let's go all right so we're going to be jumping in using a full lineage of evil setup because obviously that suits cooler quite well he is blast based and not only that he does get his full main abilities out of this or unique abilities because he wants to be alongside either lineage of evil event exclusive or movies alongside him we've got the goku and freezer getting a zenkai buff three times so they should be able to help us out and then we got a defensive abilities from the revival freezer hopefully to tank any sort of rise and rushes and things like that as well unfortunately we can't zenkai buff the cooler on this team because there's no zenkai buff for lineage of evil and green so you could possibly get that in a movies team but i do think this setup is going to work a little bit better for the cooler and alongside that we're also using the brand new uh, equipment that came with his event which gives extra strength Strike attack, blast attack, strike defense, blast defense, extra health and special move damage. So it should make him look pretty good in this. So let me know down below which is your favorite of the two free to play units, the Android 13 or the cooler. And if you haven't already, make sure to hit that like and subscribe. And without further ado, let's jump into some rank PVP. Hopefully cooler will look quite good and he can do some damage. So let's see, let's go. Okay, looks like we're gonna start off against a universe rep or god king. What God key, whatever you want to call it, really. There is Gogeta, which isn't the greatest for Cooler, but we'll see what we can do. Okay, so we're starting off against the Revival Goku. Nice. Uh, could have sworn I clicked that earlier, but fine. Uh, I'm actually going to go into you, because we're going to heal some of this off. The Go Freezer should help us out quite a bit during this. Nice. I tell you what, let's do this. Okay, that's fine. Uh, extra card draw speed. He can't switch now. And we're going to do this. Once again. Up in that sub count. And there you go. MUI's gone, so that'll put us in good stead here. I'm going to pop the green card so we lower the sub count. And we'll do that as well. Nice, okay. Not the best damage, but not the worst. Let's go into the Goku Freezer here. That's not the greatest. At least, uh, probably going to pop our revive. We'll see. Is he? No, he's not. Okay, let's pop this. And you've overextended. Right, let's go into Cooler. That's some nice damage against Revival Goku there. And then we're going to do it with the blue cards. There's Gogeta. Okay. Yep, we'll do that and then pop this. Can we get the Rise and Rush? Yes, we can. Hopefully this should be Gogeta gone. Let's go with Strike. Not much of an option there, unfortunately. I think we've almost got our Vanish back as well. Good, good, good. I will take that. Goodbye, Gogeta, who's the biggest issue here for Cooler. And now we've just got the Revival Goku. All right, this is going quite well. I'll definitely take this. With Cooler looking okay. Nice. All right, good, good, good. Right, we can... I'm going to pop the main. Oh, okay. Apparently it wouldn't let me pop it, but that's fine. Let's do the strike cancel. <laughs> okay. All right, then. Um, green cards, possibly. I mean, ultimately, Cooler's done his bit in here anyway, so 
we'll take it. He's got no Vanish now either. Maybe we can get the LF off with a Goku Freezer. Let's see. I mean, oh, he might have Vanish actually. No, he does not. And there is the LF. Decent. Okay, that was a good first showing for Cooler. Uh, especially with the green cards reducing that scub count and then the blast armor. And he's doing a fair amount of damage, obviously not against Gogeta, but against the revival Goku and things. He looked okay. He looked okay. So I'll definitely take that. And like I said, at least we get to see this LF. I do enjoy watching it. So I tell you what, after this LF, let's jump into another match and hopefully we can see more out of the cooler. Let's get into it. All right, up against another universe rep with once again Goku Black on it as well. Let's start off with our cooler, and uh, then we'll go revival and the Goku and Freeze and see what we can do. Let's get into it. Come away, all right. She's going to be a bit of an issue, but let's see. Okay. Nice, 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 nice. I will definitely take that. Are you going to switch? Yes, you are into Jiren. Okay. Um, the cost is a bit ridiculous here, I'm not going to lie. Let's start building you up. This is probably going to hurt when he uses that blue card. Yep. Um, okay, pop that so we can get a green card for the cooler, I guess. Okay. Let's go into the cooler here. And that's not bad damage. Let's do that, get an extra card, reduce that sub count. Yeah, not too bad, not too bad to start off with there. Tanking okay against quite a high star Jiren as well, to be fair. Um, right. Now we are full power Jiren, okay. Uh, Goku Freezer. Can you tank this for me? I did swipe there, I promise. But whatever. Right, let's go into revival here. To take this. It's not going the best so far, but maybe we can start a combo soon. Nice, 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 nice. Let's go into Cooler. Yep, we're going to use that, lower that sub count. And he also has some debuffs depending on the type he's up against as well. So remember that. Uh, okay, yeah, fair enough. Let's pop this and then we'll do that. How much damage can we do? That is not a lot of damage whatsoever. Nice, 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 nice. Right, we don't have to worry about cover changes there. You know what? I'm just going to rise in with a freezer here. Sure. Um, let's go with a blast. Should be obvious we have a blue because he just switched units. If he knows anything about the Goku and freezer, so I don't want to go with that. Okay, good. That wasn't strike. Nice. We've almost got our vanish back as well because without recovery, so... Because it is post um, the buff for the Goku and Frieza. Okay, alright, fair enough. He just went straight away then. I thought I'd get him with a double jump, but apparently not. I don't want to go into Cooler. But I should have gone into Cooler actually there. Because he could have healed it all back with his cards and things as well. I'm sort of trying to prepare for the rise and rush, I'm not going to lie. Gonna do this. Nice, okay. That was not very good at all. Go for a strike for me. He does. Oh, he's nullified the endurance, fantastic. And he got his vanish back, how did he get his vanish back? Right, I'm going to have to go into you. This is not looking good. Okay. Nope. 
That's some nice damage there from Cooler, to be fair to him. Unfortunately, the cost is just ridiculous. Well, Revival's gone here. I'm just going to have to let him go. Okay. Nice. Right. You know what? That's what he was waiting for. I know he's got a blue card. Oh, maybe you don't. Maybe you used all the uses up for it. Okay. Goku and Freezer, come on, come back for us here. Why does everyone keep rushing? <laughs> Let's. Right, okay, fantastic. Nice, okay. Let me use all the strikes. We have cover change notification doesn't go into Rose Goku Black that's interesting okie dokie and that was a lot better than the last one that we did okay and we've got the LF as well all right a bit of a back and forth match there to be honest mainly because of Rose Goku Black and I'm gutted that it just Fell straight into that trap of the Rise and Rush with Cooler. Like I said, people keep Rise and Rushing in, but... Oh, well. We've already seen the LF anyway, so let's carry on and jump into another match. Let's go. Okay, looks like up next is a regen team. So nice to see something a bit different with Ultra Kid Boo and Android 17. Let's see what we can do against this one, I guess. Okay, Kid Boo could be a bit of an issue just because of his toxic green card, but we will see. Um, yep. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. You know that you got Blast Armor. Which uh, not everybody knows that, to be honest. Um, right. I'm going to go into the Revival Freezer so we can get some hits off. Because remember, Cooler does get extra buffs for that as well. Okay. There we go. Now we can bring him straight back in. Okay. I'm going to go for a tackle here. Nice. You don't have your gauge quite yet. That's some decent damage, to be fair, from Cooler there. I'll take that. I'm actually just going to pop this as well and just throw this blue card out. Why not? Uh, I mean, we got our Vanish back, but I wanted to use the blue card. <laughs> but it just got rid of it. Fantastic. Uh, once again, we'll start building them up. I mean, it'd be nice if he had that ability, um, but then also a cover change. That would be nice. So you can lower the cut sub count and build his damage up and then use a cover change, possibly just use a blue, but apparently no, is the thing with that. Right, Kid Boo is fully healed as well, which is a bit of an issue there. Um, okay. And again for me. Oh no, that's a really good main. Oh, okay. Didn't capitalize on it. That's a lot of damage there from Cooler. And let's do this. Can we get another card? We can. Some nice damage there from Cooler. And we've almost got our Vanish back as well, I was about to say. Right, let's go into you so we can start. Okay. Yeah, 17, sure, whatever, but with Kid Boo and the 17, you may as well just use the Rise and Rush and try to farm another one, to be honest. Right. I want to start building up the Goku so we can get into Freeza as soon as possible, because that Kid Boo's sort of walling them out at the moment. Sure, he's got his full gauge as well. Nice. So I'll use the strikes. So we don't have to worry there. There you go. 17 is gone, which is nice. Nice, 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 nice. 
Right, okay. Um, I'm going to pop this. And we can start getting some green cards. Not green cards, sorry. Uh, blue cards, I guess. Let's do this. And is Kid Boo finished here? Yes, he is. Decent. Okay. All right, then. And... Yep, we got a forfeit. Okay, that was quite a quick match, to be fair. And Kula did do his bits in there, to be fair. And we got him built up, so not a bad show. And let's do one more. Okay, this is similar to a team I did on the channel not so long ago, actually. It's pretty much a powerful opponent with Zenkai boosts in it. And the Goku and Frieza as well. Um, okay, let's see what we can do. Okay, I think Kid Boo's going to be the biggest pain here, I think. Because um, he's the one getting the Zenkai bust buff as well. Right, well, we're going to cancel that straight away. Um, nope. Stop you doing that, thank you. Okay. Um, yeah, that wasn't the greatest, but it was good enough, though. Right, let's start building the Goku and Freezer up here, because we do want them to go into Freezer as much or as quickly as possible. Um, fantastic, let's... I'm gonna do this. You are sidestepping. Um, let's do that, get some more key back and a blast card as well. And there goes all our cards. Fantastic. Ah, uh, hello. Should have been able to get out of that, should I not? Right, cooler. Tank for us, please. Uh, okay. Nope, we're going to stop that. Thank you. That sub count manipulation is very handy. And then we're going to do this. Up your sub counts. Then we're going to go into Freezer. Um, and we'll just use one of these blue cards, I guess. I was going to rise him, but I think he would have just brought Boo in. And Ooh, okay, Jiren is gone. Right, okay, fantastic. Uh, hello, I was sidestepping. Apparently not, though. Let's go into Revival Freezer here. Still building up the cooler as well, I believe, because it's up to 10 times. This person does play very oddly, I'm not going to lie. Okay, I'll take that, I guess. Um, let's go into the Goku Freezer. Just do a bit of damage here, I guess. <laughs> he likes tackles, doesn't he? Okay, and now we can go into Revival again. Gonna have to go into him anyway. Okay. That's not the greatest, but we're just gonna let that Revival go, I think. Okay, all right. Well, we can actually rise it now as well. You know what, let's just do it. Uh, strike. Yeah, good, good, good. If I be honest, normally I wouldn't norm I'd say don't just randomly rise and rush, but I know he didn't have a vanish, or I don't think he did at the very least. And he was staying in, so I thought, why not? Yeah, stop doing that, basically. Let's do this. Okay, fair enough. That's going to do some damage. Nice, 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 nice. Right, cooler. Finish this off for us. We haven't done a lot in this match, but it'd be nice. Can you finish it off with a blue card? I should have just done the green, if i be honest. But yes, you can, and we get the win screen. So not too bad. I think I'll leave it there, but the cooler's looking okay. Granted, it takes a little while for him to sort of 
roll with those buffs and build him up a little bit. Oh, nice mission plans. Uh, it does take a little while to build him up somewhat with your, um, with your allies getting hit and things like that. But once he is fully built up, got his main ability and stuff, he can do some serious damage. And I've said this before on a previous live stream, I do like the sort of setup with him because he is a blast based unit which fits for LOE which is really nice but also he's also got um, blast armor on his strike cards as well so you can use it for de defensive capabilities which is really nice. The only thing is with his sort of buffs and needing the allies to be hit and things like that as well like I said a bit earlier on I think I would have liked to have seen some sort of cover change possibly so you can really take advantage of that but oh well it is is what it is he's looking okay especially at 14 stars not too bad let me know your thoughts down below and let me know which one's your favorite out of the android 13 and the cooler down below in the comments if you haven't already make sure to hit that like and subscribe thank you very much for watching until next time i'll catch you later ciao